Hi, I'm your host, Susan Zahari. Today we are going to visit my favorite amusement park, Cedar Point. When you think about world record-breaking roller coasters, one amusement park comes to mind, Cedar Point. Cedar Point is home to 16 of the world's greatest roller coasters. Four of these coasters are over 200 feet tall. And with a total of 67 rides in the park, there is plenty to do for everyone. Today I will be taking you on the grand tour of this amazing park. More than three million people visit Cedar Point every year, and I would like to invite you to be our guest. I hope you will enjoy Coasters Gone Wild. Cedar Point is more than just coasters. Cedar Point is home to more thrilling rides than any place on the planet. Boasting an unmatched collection of 67 amazing rides, from rocking and rolling, twisting and shouting, rotating upside down, drop suddenly, or thrust upward at great speeds, Cedar Point is just the place to get your blood circulating. This historic amusement park is home to 67 rides, making it the largest amusement park in the world. Cedar Point Resort is the world's leader with an astonishing array of 16 coasters, more than any other place on planet Earth. People throughout the entire world know about Cedar Point. For the sixth consecutive year, Cedar Point was voted the best amusement park in the world in the 2003 Golden Ticket Awards a prestigious annual poll conducted by Amusement Today newspaper. When it comes to coasters, Cedar Point's coasters have simply gone wild. Cedar Point is located on a scenic 364-acre peninsula on Lake Erie. It has one of the largest marinas on the Great Lakes. Cedar Point is celebrating its 135th season in 2004. This historic amusement park is currently the second oldest continually operated park in North America. Cedar Point owes its existence to Lake Erie and the White Sand Beach along the northern shore. The beach first began drawing guests back in 1870. Hotel Breakers first opened its doors in 1905 as the largest and greatest hotel on the Great Lakes. The hotel's original lobby is beautifully decorated with Tiffany stained glass windows and a four-story rotunda which still welcomes guests to this day. The 650-room Hotel Breakers will take you back a step in time. Cedar Point has an unusual combination of old-fashioned charm combined with a high-tech amusement park. This historic amusement park continues to draw people from all over the world. Roller coasters are nothing new to Cedar Point. The park first introduced its first roller coaster to the guests in 1892 called the Switchback Railway. The Switchback Railway took its passengers on a brief journey down a 25-foot tall hill at a speed of 10 miles per hour. Little did they know that this would be the beginning of a great amusement park. And now what we have all been waiting for, those famous Cedar Point coasters that have simply gone wild. And now to begin our 16 coaster countdown. Number 16 is the Blue Streak, which opened in 1964. Cedar Point built a wooden classic coaster that still thrills guests to this day called the Blue Streak. The Blue Streak is the oldest roller coaster operating at Cedar Point. Its first hill is 78 feet tall 
and with speeds up to 40 miles per hour. Don't let its size and speed surprise you. This wooden coaster will shake you right out of your seat. And number 15 is the Cedar Creek Mine Ride, which opened in 1969. Feel the wind in your face as you take a trip back to the gold rush days of yesteryear. The Mine Ride is the second oldest coaster still in operation today at Cedar Point and was one of the first coasters to use tubular tracks. Although it looks like a wooden mine ride, the Mine Ride is in fact a steel roller coaster with steel rails. And number 14 is the Wildcat, which opened in 1970. The Wildcat is the third oldest operating coaster at Cedar Point. Quick turns and frequent dips make this coaster a wild ride. Guests ride in individual four-person cars that zoom over hills and fly around tight corners in a figure eight design. It is an action-packed coaster. And number 13 is the Corkscrew, which opened in 1976. The Corkscrew was the first roller coaster to span a midway and the world's first triple looping coaster. It takes guests upside down not once, not twice, but three times in approximately two minutes. And number 12 is the Gemini, which opened in 1978. On your mark, get set, go. The Gemini is the only roller coaster at Cedar Point with two trains running simultaneously on parallel tracks, which race for a first place finish. You have to experience it to believe it. And number 11 is the Gemini Junior, which opened in 1979. This kid-sized coaster is special training for future coaster riders. Special seats make it possible for parents to ride side by side with their children and show them how to ride coasters when they grow up. And number 10 is the Iron Dragon, which opened in 1987. The Iron Dragon is a suspended roller coaster. Passengers are suspended below the track in four-person carriages that swing above the treetops and over a misty lagoon. And number nine is the Magnum XL200, which opened in 1989. This coaster didn't just break world records, it shattered them. Standing at an amazing 205 feet above the earth and cruising at a top speed of 72 miles an hour, this screen machine was the tallest and the fastest roller coaster ever created when it debuted in 1989. It continues to give you a feeling of floating over each of the ride's intense hills. And number eight is 
the disaster transport which opened in 1990. Passengers aboard this coaster are treated to the unique experience of complete darkness. This coaster provides a unique experience to those who have no fear of the dark. And number seven is the Mean Streak, which opened in 1991. Mean Streak is a wild wooden roller coaster that is not only great to ride, but is a wonder to look at. Made from 1.7 million board feet of treated southern yellow pine, Mean Streak is still one of the tallest and fastest wooden roller coasters on the planet. This wooden forest of hills and thrills features a stunning 161 foot tall first hill and travels at speeds of 65 miles per hour. And number six is the Raptor, which opened in 1994. The Raptor is one of the tallest and fastest inverted roller coasters in the world. It stands 137 feet high and moves at 57 miles per hour. Guests ride in cars that are suspended from the track above. Specially designed seats allow passengers' legs to dangle, providing the sensation of flight. Aiding that is the fact that the riders go upside down six amazing times. The highlight is a first-of-its-kind Cobra Roll, a thrilling element that flips riders over, spirals them upside down into a 180-degree roll, and repeats this twisting motion in reverse. And number five is the Mantis, which opened in 1996. The Mantis is one of the tallest stand-up roller coasters in the world. Towering a whopping 145 feet above the ground, this gigantic still screen machine takes its passengers along 3,900 feet of twisting, turning track at a hair-raising top speed of 60 miles per hour. And number four is the Woodstock Express, which opened in 1999. 
The Woodstock Express is a family-styled coaster located in Camp Snoopy. This coaster was built with families in mind. Each car is designed so that parents can ride and enjoy this coaster with their children. And number three is the Millennium Force, which opened in the year 2000. Cedar Point took the roller coaster record book to new heights and speeds in 2000 with the addition of the Millennium Force. This coaster takes its passengers to an incredible 310 feet above the ground and reaches a top speed of 93 miles per hour. Millennium Force destroyed 10 world records when it debuted in the year 2000. In 2003, Millennium Force was voted number two in the best steel roller coaster category in a poll conducted by Amusement Today. And number two is the Wicked Twister, which opened in 2002. This is a roller coaster with a twist. This screen machine has a U-shaped track with the ends reaching 215 feet into the air and is powered by a linear induction motor. Riders sit in special seats suspended from the track above. The Wicked Twister launches riders forward out of the station up a 90-degree twisting steel track at the speed of 72 miles per hour. Once the train slows to a stop, it streaks back down the structure and into the station before being launched backward up another twisting track. The train races up and down the track a total of five times at an amazing top speed of 72 miles per hour. But that is not all. Each tower twists 450 degrees, providing one of the most unique ride experiences ever. And number one is Top Thrill Dragster, which opened in 2003. Dragster is the newest coaster at Cedar Point. With the opening of Dragster in 2003, Cedar Point now has 16 roller coasters in the park. Reaching the stratosphere of 420 feet, 
and an unheard speed of 120 miles per hour and a vertical drop of 400 feet. Top Thrill Dragster helped Cedar Point reclaim the title of owning the tallest and fastest roller coaster on Earth. Riders begin their journey aboard ultra fuel trains that resemble fuel dragsters. The train then moves into a starting line position where it is launched forward, reaching 120 miles per hour in approximately four seconds. The train then zooms straight up the 420 foot tall hill on track that rotates 90 degrees, crests the coaster's apex and then free falls back to earth. As the train falls back to the ground, the track twists an unbelievable 270 degrees. If you just feel like relaxing, Cedar Point offers deluxe resort accommodations on their beautifully manicured one mile long beach, an indoor and two outdoor swimming pools, jacuzzis, a 50 styles ice cream shop, coffee shop, gift shops, and much more are located at the Hotel Breakers. If you prefer the outdoor life, the upscale camping complex includes 64 lakeside cottages, cozy cabins, and 97 luxury RV sites. So whatever your lodging preferences are, Cedar Point has just the right accommodations for your family as you enjoy your vacation. Cedar Point is also home to an 18-acre water park called Soak City. The play area includes more than 100 different wet and wild gadgets that spray, squirt, and drench its guests. It's the coolest way to beat the heat at Cedar Point. There is plenty for kids to do at Cedar Point. Kids have a large assortment of rides to choose from. This is the training area for future coaster riders. When you need a break from riding the tallest and fastest coasters on planet Earth and are still looking for that next thrill, then Challenge Park is just the place for you. Challenge Park is located adjacent to Cedar Point. The first thrill in Challenge Park is Ripcord. Prepare to plunge on a 15-story terror that sends you plummeting and soaring on the same flight. The second thrill in Challenge Park is Challenge Golf. Enjoy the ultimate in putting fun and unusual miniature golf hazards. The next thrill in Challenge Park is Challenge Racing. Put your pedal to the metal and feed your need to speed. Thank you for joining us today as we visited the roller coaster capital of the world. I hope you will join me next year as Cedar Point unveils all of its surprises that it has in store for 2005.